Horsepower is an initiative that uh, was thought of a few years ago when uh, we saw where the sport was heading. We need better and higher quality horses all the time. If looking at the future, we need to bring in more new horse owners to be able to be at the highest level and compete against the best. As an American who's lived in the United Kingdom for more than 20 years, I'm often asked, why are all my event horses ridden by a New Zealand rider? And the answer is because my rider, Dan Jocelyn, is one of the world's best cross-country riders. I think owners uh, like to support New Zealand riders because um, most of us who come over here, we, we come over and are very competitive. And I think owners generally like the atmosphere in our camp. It's a very relaxed, it's very friendly, it's very welcoming. We have a great um, sort of team spirit within the New Zealand High Performance Program. Um, obviously we're all fierce competitors, but we get on really well. I think the benefits for an owner of having a New Zealand rider riding for them are that we're, we're the best, obviously. <laughs> no, um, we are, you know, we've got some fantastic New Zealand riders, but we have a fantastic um, you know, program around our owners and supporters as well. We have a lot of fun. We've got you know, great hospitality, like here at Badminton, and a lot of events in England, as well as events in New Zealand, like Horse of the Year show. We have a fantastic hospitality sort of set up there and it's a lot of fun to get involved with the New Zealand um, eventing program. It really is all about the Olympics and the worlds for us as riders within Team New Zealand um, and it is truly unique that the owners get a, they are part of that journey. There's so many benefits of having a, um, an event horse with a New Zealand rider. Um, we're a very strong team at the moment. Um, and the next few years heading towards Tokyo. Um, we've got a really strong bunch of horses coming through. The eventing world is you go to your badmintons or your burleys and your five days, it's incredibly exciting. It's, it's I, to me, it's nothing else beats it really exciting. I mean, thir 12, 13 minutes cross country course with 35 fences is a, a heart starter. <laughs> Unquestionably, my favourite event is badminton. It's the pinnacle. It's everybody's dream. It's just such a privilege to be here. I feel very lucky to be part of a team um, that makes the owners feel that we're involved in something special in a sport that we all feel very passionate about. Well, this is a nice thing about our sport is we can involve the owners to a high degree. They're involved in the day-to-day -day environment. They can be involved at uh, trainings and also at competitions. One of the first examples of an owner for me was when um, Bill and Judy Hall of Woolrest stepped in and bought uh, Charisma, um, the horse that uh, won me the two Olympic gold medals. After the first Olympics in Los Angeles, he was put up for sale. Um, they stepped in and bought him and then for them went on and won a second gold medal. And uh, you know, without their um, input into it, I certainly wouldn't have had the horse uh, to ride and we wouldn't have won a second gold medal. Today, cross country day, badminton, there'll be upwards of 150,000 people here. So that as a businessman in terms of having that sort of opportunity to, 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 to market to that, uh, to that audience, but equally, it's been televised. It's live on the BBC on the red button today. There's a big highlight show tomorrow. Um, so that just creates loads of opportunities in terms of uh, marketing your products, your services, um, and your business. Being part of Team New Zealand, there's some great functions that uh, team events that Team New Zealand put on, hospitality days uh, like we recently had at Badminton. Um, and then, of course, there's the actual journey of the competition, you know, being being a part of that horse and, and us as a rider all sort of combines to the, ex the overall experience. I've now got, um, I think, five or six horses with Tim and Janelle, where I own 10% to 25% to 30%. Um, and, uh, you know, it's as much fun, but you're able to have more horses and hopefully, you know, spread the risk a bit. And then you can have some younger ones, some middle ones, and some older ones that are competing at top level so you get a sort of a bigger spread. It's almost like a you know a club they sort of uh, become part of that club the owners are often friends with other owners within the sport and um, they too sort of share a, a similar journey. Without them we wouldn't be able to sustain or keep these horses at this level. Um, while it's hugely competitive and uh, it's a busy 
uh, scene and lifestyle. It is a huge amount of fun and these owners often go on to be lifelong friends. There's, the, there's a cross section of people that would come to an event like this. You know, as much as you, you've got the sort of the general horse rider, um, you know, you've got high net worth individuals as well. So, you know, it's, it's, it's a real cross section and that's one of the things I love about the sport. It's, it's pretty classless. There's a great camaraderie amongst the team and uh, if, if an owner and a rider are lucky enough to have a horse that's uh, going to, looks like it's going to represent New Zealand, um, gets brought into the high performance squad and with that you have the benefits of extra assistance with vets and travel and, and training and everything else and, uh, and closer into this uh, event and family.